Dermot Drummy makes four changes to the team that performed so well in that 3-0 victory over Charlton a fortnight ago. Anton Rogers and Bobby Devine join Marko Mitrovic to form a new look attack. Aldi Haxia takes over from Nicholas Hyman in goal. Sam Walker is still out injured. They switch the ball forward, a nice flick from Murray. Options in the middle here. Griffiths with the header, narrowly wide. Keeper didn't deal with it and they're left ruining that chance. George Savile perhaps should have been marking a little closer as a free header for Griffith. Confusion in the Chelsea midfield as everyone's left watching. Lavery breaking forward. The cross is charged down, but it's not been cleared, and that's over. Luke Heim with a big chance there, and he knows it. Chelsea defence, well, you have to say, looked in disarray there. Technique wasn't good enough, though. He's not crossing the halfway line. He's still going. Skips past one challenge, drifts one in. Marko Mitrovic holding up the ball well. Chelsea retain possession. Oh, and a solid challenge. And a free kick quite rightly given. There's a little bit of afters. Billy Clifford didn't like that challenge. And here's why. Off the ground, that's dangerous. So, free kick to Chelsea. Dangerous position, plenty of contenders standing over the ball. It'll be Anton Rogers to hit it, and he's hit it well. Keeper left stranded. That's his first goal of the season. And didn't he take it well? Just inside the post, Chelsea 1-0. So Blues, a goal to the good. Someone against the run of play, but they're pouring forward now. Lovely ball forward by Anton Rogers. And a great shot from Bobby Devine, just tipped over. Good play from the Blues. Cracking through ball. Splitting the defence to take the touch. A little wider than he wanted to be and a good save. Billy Clifford plays it long. Easily headed away. The real ping pong continues and Chelsea are guilty of ball watching here. Tom Hayden. Well, he should have got the challenge in. Ronan Murray was allowed to get the shot away. Pulled it wide though. Should have dealt with it. Keeper covering his goal well. And a let off for Chelsea. Not. He's looked lively coming in off that left hand side. Little flick through. Just over by Jarlo. Great chance for Chelsea. Great build up play too. Billy Knott, the architect, once again driving the run in and flicking it through. Mitrovic with a clever bit of play. Jarlo well, just couldn't get it on target. Switch, forcing the issue now. Lovely little cushioned header. Corley with the shot, it's been saved. No, it's gone into the back of the net. Agonizing for Chelsea. Ipswich celebrate. It was Ronan Murray with the softest of headers. And a great finish. Aldi Haxia won't want to see that one again though. Pass again, well done. Come on, Callum, It's been some pretty neat interplay from both sides in this game. Ipswich driving forward now. The tackle's not a convincing one. The strike is, though, and that's a great goal for Ipswich. Lavery with a cracking goal to take the lead. You don't want to point individual fingers, but... George Savile there, perhaps should have dealt with the challenge a little better. Strong finish, though. Tractor boys with the corner. It's not been dealt with, and a shot from Meekings. Cleared off the line by Jarlo. Skipper coming to the rescue for Chelsea there. Big crowd of players, which have plenty of height in that area. 
couple ricocheting around and finally safe. Chelsea chasing the equaliser. Mitrovic with a diagonal ball. Here's Billy Knott cutting into the right foot and what a strike and what a goal! Right in the top corner. Absolutely sensational from Billy Knott. Fullback is absolutely flying. That's four goals in four games for the left back. And this has got to be the pick of the bunch. One for the scrapbook, that's for sure. Unbelievable. We played with 10 minutes for how long?